And now, 10 zines in two minutes. Giant Monster Cash Grab by Dorji Bulls is about corporations building monstrosities to battle for economic domination. Dorji paints a picture of a dystopic future where there's nothing left to celebrate but violence and profit. Sunflowers and Rainbows by Kariska is about unicorns that eat music made by sunflowers. It's a happy all-ages fairy tale full of bright colors, imaginative characters, and adorable fantasy shenanigans. Sabertooth Vampire by Mike Russell is about the tribulations of a dentally gifted Nosferatu. Russell displays remarkable skill at producing zine after zine of stupidly hilarious visual comedy. Seeking Truth by Charles Doherty is about the author asking strangers if they've seen his buddy named Truth. It's the continuation of a short film by the same name that chronicles Doherty's particularly interesting social experiment. Extraordinary by Nielsen and Grigsby is about the difference between having superpowers and being a superhero. We're introduced to Freddy, a kid with genuine superpowers, discovering that fighting crime isn't exactly a realistic pursuit. iBot by S. Mann is about autonomous cybernetic vision implants enjoying surreal adventures. It takes place in a world where it's perfectly acceptable to tell a stranger you have optical implants by extending them from your skull. Eat 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 by Tom Van Dusen is a gross reflection on gluttony, vanity, and other modern charms. Dusen's comics aim to disturb you by excessively exaggerating perfectly realistic Western values. Foulmouth Little Bastard by Seth D. Witts is a lovable non-fiction autobiography that delivers exactly what it says on the label. Seth is quite literally a very small man with a very large temper who tells his remarkable life adventures through comics. Meow by Narbu is about a bunny feeding mac and cheese to a cat. Narbu is a prolific Seattle painter whose comical art style has inevitably led him to crafting light-hearted, nonsensical comic stories. And finally, Butts to Butts by Laura Davis is the best goddamn comic book ever made in the history of everything forever. In only 11 pages, Davis will create a world, endear you to the characters, and blow your mind out the back of your skull with immaculate demonic artwork. I'm Jer, and this has been 10 Zines in 2 Minutes on Comic Soup.